Finance Minister Arun Jaitley has said that the government will recover 70,000 crores from 12 defaulters before the end of March this year. Alicia has the details. The Finance Minister has announced that 70,000 crore rupees will be recovered by banks from the country's 12 biggest defaulters before the end of March. This thanks to the bankruptcy reform seen as one of the landmark reforms by the NDA government in the resolution of stressed assets. Mr. Jaitley has said that thanks to this reform, an extremely satisfactory condition has been upon us. The creditor no longer has to chase the debtor. Banks have already got back 80,000 crores till last year from 66 cases resolved under the NCLT. Now the finance minister says that from these 12 cases alone, and he names SR Steel and Bhushan Power in Steel, 70,000 crore rupees will be realised. But has this recovery come at a big cost? Because the claims on these 12 cases are 3 lakh and 45,000 crore rupees. SR alone is 80,000 crore rupees and Bhushan 56,000 crores. Uh, one can look at it to say that, uh, you know, only 45% of uh, 45 or thereabouts um, of the capital has been restored. But the good news has been that uh, there is a very clear path that the IBC has shown uh, on assets uh, which, uh, which, which, which were undergoing restructuring and which were not getting to a resolution. So there's a very clear path and there is, clear, there is certainty as to how they, those will get resolved. The government and the Reserve Bank say that NPAs or bad debts have peaked this year. But it's also a crucial year to see how much of the debt left, estimated at 3 lakh crore rupees, can actually be recovered under the IBC. Remember that the 12 biggest loan defaulters in the country account for 25% of all of its non-performing assets. Alicia Sachdev for NDTV.